So guys, so we're going to do a Try Not To Lie Challenge today. And on this video called, What Could Possibly Go Wrong? Fail of the Week, Crazy Clips. So, you know what time it is. It's game time. Oh my god, that's so cool. Oh my god, Joe, what are you, you a jerk? I don't think it was real. I don't think that was real. You're a terrible jerk for making her do Talking about instant regret on the when he broke through the, the water line. This is what grown ups do in their own vacation. Oh dear. That woman laughing was funny, eh? Almost sounded like she was, uh, she was dying. Or she had some bronchitis or something like that. My friend came from Miami and is her first time seeing snow falls. Where are you going, bro? Erica! Oh my god! Oh my god! No, Erica! No! No, Erica! No, Erica! Oh my god! No! No! Bro, she put that big ass puddle, bro. This dude act like he has to wa he has to wash her damn clothes. Dishwashing liquid. Yes, yes. It said dishwashing yep. liquid. Yep, you know you're Miami when when he says some stuff like that. That's Miami. And I'm from Miami.
be crying.
I remember there was this story. There was this video I saw where there was this dude. He was like dressed up, like suited up and everything. Like he was suited, like he was ready to go on a, on, on a wedding or some shit like that. And they were at the mall, and he went to jump down to his knees. Keep in mind, they were in the food court. He dropped down to his knees, and he proposed to his girlfriend. And they only see each other for like maybe a couple months, maybe like two or three months. And after the two or three months, he dropped down to his, to one knee and proposed to her. And the girl left. She didn't even say anything. That girl said, she said no and walked it off. You know, because, you know, she felt embarrassed. Because maybe, you know, it, it depends how long they've been, they've been knowing each other and stuff like that. And maybe they, she wasn't ready. But, man, this dude, however, only two, three months and he had proposed to her. Psh, he got embarrassed. They both got embarrassed. You know, I felt bad because, you know, the girl could have just said no and say they had to go. Like, the way how the girl did it, like, she could have said at least say no, okay? And kind of left off the scene because she feel embarrassed. The other one that I, I saw is, is some video there that I watched. She didn't even say no. She just got, she just walked. She just walked off. She was just so shocked and so, just couldn't believe it. You know, I was like... Man, oh my god. I was like, dude, you had to know that it was coming, man. It's only two, three months. And you all want to get to, you want to marry her? You haven't fully got to know her. Like, how does that even, hey man, trust me. You'll know whether a few months, whether and about, if you're going to marry her. It takes you kind of. A, a while for you to figure out on whether or not she, he or she is the one. So, fellas, don't embarrass yourself. Do not embarrass yourself. Always trust your gut. You gotta trust your gut and you gotta get to know her properly. Okay, you'll know. And don't get, don't get too emotionally attached to that girl because you don't know if she's giving you any red flags or not, and you don't know what's, what kind of chemistry you guys have together. So it's always best to use your comments, use your sense, use your logic, and understand who you're dealing with. So that way you know whether or not she's really ready or not, and how you guys are as far as chemistry wise goes. You know, because when you're mostly attached to that person, sometimes you get up like that. So. <laughs> But anyway, I'm not going to get any further than that. That one to me was the craziest one. The funniest one, I would say, when the, I guess, one, well, there was other ones I can't really remember at the moment. But when the girl got stuck from the ice cream cone, that one was pretty funny. The way how they set it up almost, I almost had like a dirty joke for, for a minute there. But, uh, you know, no pun intended, of course. I'm not going to get any further than that. But, uh. Either way, this challenge has rest in peace. So, did any of you guys participate in this Try Not To Laugh challenge? If you did, let me know in the comment below if you pass or if you fail. And if you enjoy my video, you can go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe and share. Make sure you guys click on the notification bell so that way you guys can get more upcoming videos in the near future. And if there's any videos you guys want me to, uh, you want me to check out a video, any videos requests, you can always just leave it in the comment section down below. Alright guys, well, until next time, peace out.